What's up, YouTube? This is Too Raw for TV. So, last night, uh, it was reported, likely, that Rajon Rondo was on his way to Cleveland. And now it is official. According to Sham Sharania of The Athletic, the Los Angeles Lakers have traded Rajon Rondo to the Cleveland Cavaliers. Now, of course, the Cleveland Cavaliers desperately needed a point guard after the season ending uh, injury uh, uh, acquired by Ricky Rubio. Um, now, what do the Lakers get in return? I mean, I really don't see much reported. Perhaps a second round pick and or a player by the name of Stanley Johnson. I don't know. Uh, I think these details will be um, announced uh, soon. But Rajon Rondo now is no longer a member of the Los Angeles Lakers. He had been having a horrible season, um, not the magical season and magical postseason that he had had a couple of years ago. Um, let me say this, man. I have to say this about a certain segment. I don't think it's Lake. I don't know whether it's Lakers fans, some Lakers fans, or whether it's transplanted LeBron fans, but I have a suspicion of which one it is. Some of you motherfuckers are the most ungrateful pieces of shit I have ever seen in my life. Um, look, Anthony Davis is not playing up to his standards. Absolutely. Absolutely. And should he be traded? Yeah, if you can find something better. But what I'm having a hard time understanding is he did contribute greatly to that one fucking title y'all got, okay? As did Rondo, Ronjo Rondo. And to see all of these Laker fans talk shit about Rondo and talk shit about AD to the extent that they're doing. Now, mind you, I'm not Laker fans. So I don't give a shit. But they were big contributing factors to that one fucking bubble title y'all got that y'all did get. So for y'all to be talking shit about them like they're absolute trash. I mean, okay. This is why a lot of people hope the Lakers don't want to fucking title another 50 fucking years. You already have this superiority complex where you feel like you can just pill for other people's teams and take talent from them instead of doing it the right way, which is through the draft, which is through creating, uh, you know, and, 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 and burgeoning talent. No, you got to get already made fucking uh, superstars from smaller markets and then try to have the media uh, bully them into leaving their small market to go to the Lakers and help some washed up superstar win a title to help his fucking legacy. And then when shit don't go right, all of a sudden now you want to blame the, uh, the, the add-ons. Man, fuck that. That's a raw deal to me, man. You know what I'm saying? I, I'm not a fan of Rondo. I don't like his ass. But the way people are talking about him, man, and, and 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 the way like you know, you know, some Laker fans are going in on AD. Like I said, slot of shit. Yeah, he is a soft motherfucker. He, he should be talked about. But he did at least contribute a championship to this fucking motherfucker, man. He did contribute a championship to these motherfucking um, Lakers. And to be like talking about him like he ain't done shit at all. His whole time? Wow. <laughs> like, like he, all right, whatever. 